Hello Pisces, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of February 25th through March 4th, 2019. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish, and I'm closing off with my oh, Wild Unknown Tarot by Kim Franz. I want to thank everybody for like, share, and subscribing and setting up personal readings with me. Alright guys, let's get this show on the road. Alright, you guys stop jumping out. Let's see what this is. Alright, so it seems like... Oh, goodness. Alright, so it seems like somebody's either dealing with a childhood friend or somebody that they really care about. Or it could be um, a child's parent. But I feel like this is outside of um, you. Okay? Or you outside of... The person you are most recently with or the person you are with okay yep third party situation yeah so there's somebody but this is not for everybody um i feel like this is for uh some people let me see one more card all right so it seems like whatever this is it wasn't happening all all along i feel like this just started happening somebody just started dealing with um these people okay all right, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. All right, so it seems like either you are a very arrogant person or you're dealing with an arrogant person here, okay? But I feel like there's a lot of arrogance going on. This is me. Take me as I am, like it or not. You're going to do what I say, that kind of thing. All right. Okay. So it seems like this person is very controlling and demanding because um, there's a lot of passion and, and I want to say electricity. I don't know why I wanted to say electricity, but there's a lot of passion going on here. Hmm. All right, so it seems like somebody's getting ready to try to break free from this relationship because they feel like that's all it is. This is all it's about. This is all you want. This is all I want, you know. And then somebody, I feel like, since somebody's breaking free from this, somebody may want more, but we're going to see what this freedom card is here for. All right, so it seems like there's a lot of back and forth going on in, in this relationship. And this could be a little bit of why the freedom is here. But let's see one more card for the freedom. Give me one card. One more card for the freedom for the Pisces. All right, yes, yeah, so somebody just can't take it no more. So it is the on and off, the like, I love you, I hate you kind of thing. But it's still like only thing that's bringing you guys back and forth is the passion. And it's just like somebody is just like, you know, I've just been working too hard for this, you know. Like this is all I'm getting. I need more than this. I want more than this, you know. Somebody is definitely sick of the back and forth. All right. So it seems like somebody may have some friends too. I feel like these friends are gossiping behind your back, okay? I feel like they talking crap about the negative, I mean, the uh, back and forth. All the negative stuff that happened in your relationship, the back and forth, the, that's the only reason they're there. The All the stuff you take, it's like they're putting all this negative stuff in your head. Even though it's there, they're not doing it to be friends. They're doing it to be nasty, okay, to be negative. All right. So, when you saw that flip out, so we got the rapid development. So, that if this didn't already happen, it's getting ready to, all right? All right. So, wow. So, it seems like not only is this person leaving all the time, um, this person isn't doing anything for you. I feel like anything that's uh, d being done is you giving gifts and all that kind of stuff. And it seems like, you know, it's all, it's all for the passion, Okay, as there's nothing more here. Okay. All right, so it seems like you finally found your way out. Okay, you found the end of the road. You just like this. This is the last time you're going to leave me. Okay. All right, give me one more card for this homeland. All right, so yeah, somebody's thinking about the situation. You always gone. 
this is all we only have fun time you know that's the only thing we got in common you don't do things for me i'm just so emotionally exhausted by this whole situation you know i'm sick of you okay yeah and it seems like this whole situation just makes you feel you know unloved unpretty it makes you feel like you wrong this person makes you feel like you wrong they're breaking down your spirits they're breaking down your character they breaking down they breaking you down as a person okay they're breaking you down as a person and i feel like these people these friends that were there for you i feel like they turned nasty because you turn into a different person and they don't like the person that you are and they just going about it the wrong way they just trying to be mean and nasty to you thinking it's gonna make you change but that's breaking you down as well okay you don't break friends down with negativity okay you try to tell them good things about their self compliments to make them stronger to know to get out you know but it's like you i'm mean, gonna just say you are getting beat from all sides and it's like you're getting ready to bust out of everything you just like enough okay enough all right all right what's going on with the pisces Pisces love reading for February 25th through March 4th, 2019. What's going on with the Pisces? Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right. So I do feel like some of you guys are getting ready to get some messages or pop, probably send some messages, okay? Somebody's about to send some Dear John letters, okay? I feel like somebody's about to break up through social media, maybe change their uh, relationship status, change their pictures, all that, okay? Somebody's getting ready to make it public. All right, first card we got here is the King of Pentacles. So it seems like somebody's about to devote all their time and their um uh just all their time and resources, everything they have toward um work. Okay. So somebody's turning the love switch off and turning the work switch on. Okay, somebody's going head first. Okay. Alright, so we got the seven of cups reverse. Yes, so it seems like somebody you guys had a lot of choices of what you could do with this spare time, but it seems like somebody made their choice up, but it's still a choice. So, of course, you can still change direction. But at this point, somebody just be like, I'm about to get two jobs. I'm about to get three jobs or I'm about to work night and day, you know, from the time I wake up to the time I go to sleep. You know, somebody is definitely about to um, jump head first in their business or work in general. Okay. Making the monies. All right. So we got the daughter of pinnacles uh, reversed here as well. So it seems like, of course, there's going to be a little money going out. But it seems like, you know, you spend it, you're making big money. So this money spending is, is not much. Okay. But I do feel like. I feel like somebody may be working hard to accomplish some kind of goal. Like somebody wanted to do this or make this much before this. Or um, just work hard so they can get their dream car or their dream bike or their dream whatever. Okay. Somebody's definitely turning their um, focus onto their dreams. All right. Let's see what's going on with this King of Pentacles. One card, please, for the Pisces. All right, yeah, so it seems like after this false love offer came in, um, now somebody's, I don't want to say broken, but somebody just, like, I'm done. Somebody's washing their hands with relationships right now, okay? Like, I'm sick of people coming in, saying they're doing stuff, and they don't do it, all right? That's it. What is this choice about? One card, please, for the Pisces. Nine of Cups, yeah. You know, time after time, somebody, you're going to come take care of me. You're going to go do everything I need. You're going to be there for me emotionally and all this stuff. Nine of Cups reverse. It's not happening. Okay? I'm not getting what I want, but I know I can make what I want happen materialistically. So that's what I'm going to do. That's what's happening here. All right, let's see what this 
Daughter of Pentacles is one card, please, for the Pisces. All right. So we got the Father of Pentacles reversed here. So, yeah, I feel like there might be some spending going on here. And I feel like it's to um, kind of rub it in the disloyal person face. Like, this is what you could have had. Okay, you could have been with me. You could have, you know, did the right thing, you know. But I do feel like somebody was working with some disloyal person. And this money that you're making is getting ready to go toward them, okay? Some of you guys may be getting ready to give them something or pay them off or just give them what they need to get away from you as well, okay? But I do feel like somebody is going in hard on work and I feel like it's to make uh, the person that done bad to you feel bad or um, just to give them what they want to get them out of your life, okay? Alright, so we got this Six of Swords reversed. So I do feel like somebody is getting ready to move back somewhere. Maybe, sorry, to uh, hometown. Maybe back with their parents. Um, and maybe somebody was getting ready to go on a trip. But they got to postpone it until later. Um, but I do feel like some kind of movement is going to be halted or, or, or pushed back. Uh, because of this whole situation, okay? And some of you guys may have had a trip planned with this person, but you're getting ready to cut it off, all right? But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.